<laughs> right, our next guest has sold millions upon millions, upon millions of records numbers. and tickets worldwide, but still, his proudest achievement to date was being able to sign himself on Football Manager 2014. Oh, yeah. Please give a very warm Three. Soccer AM welcome to Louis Tomlinson! <laughs> Welcome to Soccer AM. Thanks for having me on. What's Thank it? You. Uh, you know, you're here. Took us, yeah. took a while, didn't it? But we managed it. Are you enjoying it so far? Yeah, loving it. Superb. Had a little go outside, yeah? Yeah. Oh, he's yeah, been yeah. out there all morning shelling. But where? Bit slippy, innit? I'm unfit bit these slippy. days, though, man. I can feel the tightness in me quads. <laughs> mm, yeah. <laughs> I got Ross, that look, um, the football manager thing. Mm. That's real, yeah. Uh, yeah. You was actually on it? Yeah, pretty Because you was on Donny's book. Like you run it, though, no? <laughs> well, yeah. Can you? I'm a proper pro. <laughs> uh, that's what I mean. <laughs> it's a break here. Oh, but they made, our, they, they made our rubbish, like. They made me dead bad on it. No, but fair. what was it like? What was it like, signing with him? And how did it, how did it come oh, the whole thing was amazing, man. Like, obviously, like a childhood dream for me. Um, I think I'd been going down to the club a little bit, and Paul Dickoff was manager at time. Legend. Legend, man. Really, really nice bloke as well. And I think maybe I made a joke in passing about you guys should sign. You him, knew you know what, what you I were mean? doing. Of course I did. Just an idea, I did, But Paul. I didn't think I could pull it off. But then, yeah, we had like a. I was on tour at the time. Like, Sky Sports came down, did like a proper exclusive, man. It was amazing. Been awesome. the, the thing is, like, because. Paul's a, fo he's a, you know, he's a football man, you know, yeah, Paul, yeah, that's what they yeah. say, that's what your footballers say. So he's not going to, you know, he, you obviously, you can obviously play because he's not going to, you know... Do you know what was great for me? It's probably a bit unfair. Niall's an all-right football player, but when you're in a band with a group of lads who aren't great at football <laughs> and you're kind of decent, it makes you look a bit yeah, better, you know all right, I mean? okay, so It always yeah, suited yeah. me, that. Always suited me. Like False advertising, isn't it? Yeah, 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 it works for me, that. We've actually got some footage, the, the Sky Sports footage that you... Have were, you really? Have yeah, you really? let's have oh, a little look at this. Cringe, we we uh, you were playing right back. Um, your quiff was playing centre midfield. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh, so <laughs> Long barnet there, yeah. man. Love long it. hair. How, how are you feeling running on there? I, honestly, I'm terrified, man. I swear. Honestly, it's one of the most nervous I've been. Look at that. Look at yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Tracking back, though. Like it. Kept yeah. a clean sheet, though. I'm a defender, yeah. I think. We kept a clean sheet. Uh, lads, lads, we, asked, we asked for the highlights, yeah? <laughs> What's yeah, that? It's <laughs> my best beats, man. Come on. Anyway, what was it like, though? Because you're in a massive pop band, the biggest in the world, right? Yes. Was they giving you was they giving you stick on the pitch? Not so much on that game. I mean, you could feel maybe on 50-50s they're going in a bit extra, but a game before that, that was actually rescheduled because at Bongla Hall, absolutely oh, body me. Yeah. Um, so, there's definitely been a couple of games where I do feel like I've been targeted. But if the shoe were on the other foot, I'd do the same. No, right? I get it. I get it. Did they apologise yeah. for that, Gabby? Did they? Uh, it, oh, he had to, actually, yeah. He had to, like, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. yeah. racket yeah. as well. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine him running out, you'd be like, And, and are, you, are, you getting, are you getting a game, a game these days? Or is... I, I don't play enough anymore. I do miss it. We played a few times on tour this year, but I don't play enough. I would like to get back into it. OK. Now, Don is your, you know, your hometown club. Um, you were involved in a potential takeover, weren't mm. you? What, what, what happened with that? Without going into too much detail, I just learned that maybe it wasn't the best idea right. to get involved <laughs> in that capacity. I will say, before it all kind of went wrong, I, again, like a childhood dream. Like, I was going with Paul, like, to meet players yeah. that was on about side yeah. and that. And obviously, as a football fan, I was just sat there in awe with the whole situation. I was chatting to someone the other day, actually, and... and uh, talking about potentially doing something w with the team that they support mm. and it's like yeah great but then oh is it are you better just to sort of sit back sit well back i will say I've, I've, I've not been back for a while and it kind of got a bit weird right. after this so I, I agree with that yeah you sort of hang yourself out to dry a little bit aren't you but it's all coming bit. from the right place where well, you know everyone, it, everyone would do start like liverpool rob <laughs> <laughs> now, <laughs> you're all, um, you're obviously, you mentioned the boys there. Yeah. Um, they're all doing their own stuff at the minute, mm. obviously, but do you think one day that there potentially might be a, you know, a, a regrouping, a regathering? Would you like to see that? Yo, I would love to see that, yeah? Yeah, yeah. massive. Oh, yeah. Everyone like, wants to see like, that, don't they? We'd love to um, see it. Yeah, one day. I mean, I'd yeah. be pretty gutted if it didn't happen, but 
Who knows, it might be in like 10 yeah. years. Yeah. Yeah. Don't want to be right. too old. Though. I don't care if it's in 20 years. No, it's good. Yeah. Yeah. Make it happen. Yeah. We'll do it for you, Jim. Yeah. Nice. I love yeah. you. I thought you were right. amazing. Let's years. talk about your solo <laughs> career, though, which yes. is absolutely uh, yes. flying, mate. You've just come off your first world tour, apart from being absolutely exhausting. Um, how was it? Oh, you're amazing. That, that had been the moment that I'd been working up to my whole solo career, really. That was always my favourite thing to do in the band. Because this job, there's times where you're kind of trying to read between the lines. At a live show, what you see is what you get. Yeah, People yeah, have paid yeah. money to come and see you, and you get a very literal reaction from that. So it was, it's been an amazing year for me, and I've got the tour to thank for that, definitely. Is it hard to switch off after a show that big? It is, the it is. Flying, I think you know, it's like... I've got a vocal coach who like, looks after me before I go out on the road and stuff, and like, I think she'd rather I'd just go straight to bed after, but there's no chance. You're just, you're just flying. It's not yeah, a normal yeah. experience to go through, so... Normally go out for a drink with lads, yeah. It's like us after this show, innit? We're absolutely flying out, and you're like, don't have a full English, Spenners. I'm, I'm having a full English, I'm going to have an extra sausage and a bit of toast. Right. <laughs> John, boy, you New album. Me. Here it is. There it is. There it is. Hang on, colours. <laughs> Red and black. Uh, yeah, yeah. Very nice. There it is. Well, well uh, sold. Faith in the future. Faith in the future. It's out yeah. November the 11th. So good um, looking, isn't he? He's pretty handsome, isn't he? God, it's a uh, first single. Uh, let's have a look. This is the brilliant Bigger Than Me. Nice. When somebody told me I would change, I was afraid. I don't know why. Cause soon as the world outside, I bring a light. And it's bigger than me. It's bigger than me. I've woken up. That's out November the 11th. Yep. Yes. OK. Yep. Now, it, yesterday was National Album Day. I don't know if you knew that. I'm sure you are. Uh, Robbie uh, plumped for Sergeant Peppers. Sergeant Bully Peppers. still TBC. Um, it's hard, isn't it? Like, what's your favourite album ever? But favourite maybe what's your favourite at the moment, maybe? I'd say they've done a bit of touring with me, The Snuts. Oh, have they been on they've here? Been on here yeah. yeah, great live, great live band. Yeah. Their, their latest album, Ben the Empire, is brilliant, I think. Because you, I'm fair to say that you're... Um, you, 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 you know, your solo stuff has a slight more of a leaning towards like what you class indie, you know, in, indie territory. And you, you're a big advocate of, of new bands, new music. Mm. You, you, you do a lot to help, don't you? Yeah, I've got this thing that I put on. Um, I've been doing it a couple of years now, and it's like we call it a festival, basically. And uh, I mean, it's just like a one-day event, but it gives me an opportunity to be able to bring new bands on and also show my fans the kind of music I'm into. So, like, the last one we just did, I had Stone on. You know Stone? Yeah, 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 yeah. Unbelievable. Yeah. We're trying to get them on. Yeah, have a word. yeah, I will do, actually. Cheers, I bet it's will. lovely, though, because you see little gems coming through, yeah. don't you? Do oh, definitely, I mean? definitely. And also just to feel like I can give back a little bit and help with those kind of yeah, opportunities. Well but they're unbelievable, man, Stone. Yeah. Yeah, really exciting right. band. Hopefully I'll tell you what, right, we should get on. Go on. The Struts. Yes. Yes, awesome. front man. Glenn. Oh, mate. Brilliant Luke. Awesome. character. Get him on. See, I swear one on you. Wear Hope that. you brought your boots as well, mate, because uh, you'll be taking on these two in a very special You Know The Drill live. Yeah. Don't, oh, tell, don't tell this. me you've tweaked your hamstring. <laughs> I have. No, you have I not. Have. For the time being, get him out there. Get him stretched <laughs> off. It's Louis Tomlinson, everyone. Brilliant, mate. <laughs>